Now, this is not the latest and greatest when it comes to cryptocurrency news, but I wanted to give you my opinion in regards to what Bill Gates had to say about cryptocurrency. Now, lots of you probably have already read it and uh, know what he had to say, but in this video, I want to give you my opinion. Cryptocurrency kills people in fairly direct way, Bill Gates says. Now, when it comes to Bill Gates, I'm not his biggest fan. To be honest with you, I'm not the biggest fan of Microsoft either. But hey, I gotta give it to uh, to him. He's been doing obviously very well. He's done some great things in his life, without a doubt, with Microsoft. He's been doing very good. And uh, for the past few years, he's been doing very good also and very nice of him. All the charity work that uh, you know he has done, all the money that he's given away, which by the way, I don't know exactly how much he's given and what exactly he has done, but I know he's doing quite a lot. In the meantime, I have to disagree with his take on cryptocurrency. So let's see what he had to say. Microsoft founder and one of the world's richest men, Bill Gates, is no stranger to controversial statement in this last week. And this latest one takes some beating. This week, Gates made headlines after claiming that cryptocurrency is actually killing people as it appears to be too for choice for criminals and those who operate drug networks to move their ill gotten gains around. Now, not too long ago, I did make a video in regards to a company that did a research for the UK government and they established that only 1% of the cryptocurrency that is sent for, uh, to exchanges, it's actually from ill-gotten money. Therefore, we can clearly see criminals are using it just like they're using fiat money, but it's not that much. How true that is, one can only speculate, but it's certainly debatable to, to say the least. During a Reddit Ask Me Anything session, Gates explained that he thinks cryptocurrency is really bad since it helps people avoid financial transaction traceability. Uh, again, some may disagree with that, uh, especially if you are one of these people that do believe in cryptocurrency and the fact that you don't want uh, every single person out there to know what you are exactly doing. And to be honest with you, can we really trust the banks? I mean, watch the previous video where I did post uh, banks are broke. It's an interesting one. Although it's an old one, I don't think things have changed. So the main future of cryptocurrency is their anonymity. And I would disagree with that because we all know that is only with partial of cryptocurrency, not with every single one. Yes, uh, some says that uh, the, private, the privacy coins in 2018 will do very well. But let's not forget, that's not every single cryptocurrency out there. So I wouldn't say that the main thing is their anonymity. I don't think this is a good thing. The government ability to find money laundering and tax evasion and terrorist funding is a good thing, he said, pointing out that the cryptocurrency is currently used to buy drugs like fentanyl, which means that it's rare technology that has caused deaths in fairly direct way. Quite a statement from the computer mogul. And this is where I do want to give you my opinion. Let's be honest. As of lately, we've been seeing constantly cryptocurrency being bashed in regards to that particular thing that criminals are using it and you can buy things and no one knows you buying them and whatnot. But let's be honest, criminals and people that do buy drugs are also using fiat currencies such as the United States dollar, uh, British pounds and whatnot. And they pretty much buy anything and everything and I'm pretty sure that includes fentanyl. And a lot of times, nobody knows who bought it simply because they used cash in hand, fiat currency. So therefore to say that cryptocurrency is killing people because you can buy fentanyl, I mean, you can say the same for fiat money, but no one seems to be making that statement and no one seems to be out there trying to close fiat money, except us, the people that actually like cryptocurrency for what it is. Um, and that is where I'm very disappointed with this statement because fiat has been used um, for many, many, many years. Uh, many people have bought, you know, everything that you can think of, everything, including drugs, including guns and anything else. And yet we are still using it until this very, you know, day. But yet, uh, why is there no one trying to close a fiat currency, cash in hand and all that stuff? That bug, you know, and it's uh, understandable why, because it's controlled by um, governments. They can print as much as they want. Uh, it's controlled by banks. And obviously that's uh, their thing. You know, it's fiat currency. For us, it is cryptocurrency, or at least for me and many others. And I'm gonna continue to disagree with people that constantly use criminals, 
guns, drugs, and whatnot, and try to bash on cryptocurrency because of few individuals out there. I'm pretty sure there's a lot more people, criminals, let's say, that are using fiat currency than they are using cryptocurrency. And that's my opinion in regards to these guys. I'm going to link down below the full article. You can read it. Um, it was an inter interesting uh, Reddit post that, uh, you know, Bill Gates talked about a few things, but that's the one I personally wanted to address. And I have to disagree what Bill Gates said when it comes to cryptocurrency and that it's killing people. You know, cryptocurrency has changed many people's life in a positive way. And I would say, including myself, they've changed me, the way I think about cryptocurrency, the future, um, and the financial freedom, curing the middleman, cutting, cutting out banks, you know, giving us, you know, once again, the freedom to control our money instead of letting somebody else controlling our money and, letting, and pretty much telling us what we can and we can't do when it comes to our money. Um, that's it for me, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed the channel, feel free to subscribe and share. Come follow me on Twitter. Let me know what do you think. Do you agree with Bill Gates or do you disagree like myself? And all I can say is let's continue this incredible journey we are on. And let's not give, up, give in on this third and all these criminals and whatnot when it comes to cryptocurrency. We can't allow it. Few individuals out there that tend to be putting criminals and drugs and guns in the same statement as cryptocurrency uh, to make this experience pretty much the best one I had ever had in my life. It's truly amazing. That's all I can say. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.